It's a uh, three kilowatt wind uh, wind turbine. It's out of a company out of uh, Crystal Lake, Illinois. A uh, company's name is N NTP, and they manufacture them exclusively there, right in Crystal Lake. So it's a good uh, local source for our uh, our, uh, our tur wind turbine. It allows us to really concentrate our focus in on several areas which involves the grant which is where the funding came from with it uh, the National Science Foundation grant allows us to go ahead and attach into uh, a process called skate operations which is basically wind uh, reading operations with it uh, determine what the wind resources are here in the, uh, the area and to uh, be able to uh, build the uh, program based on that information for uh, future classes down the line it will power the uh, the wind turbine technology building here. Um, it's it's not uh, as big a unit as, as it, it would take to operate the building itself with it, but it'll it'll significantly uh, cut into the uh, the cost overall cost for it uh, on the, uh, the electrical end. This is a huge stuff for us. Uh, uh, Scott Anderson and Dr. Joe Kanowski, Tim Hood, uh, significant people behind the backing of this uh, to, to see this come uh, to where it's at today. This physical turbine itself here is really going to help give recognition to the program that we have. You'll remember this was the first uh, two-year program in the state of Illinois in wind turbine technology. So it just gives a physical presence of, of just what this program is doing. And uh, thanks to Dave for all his work in, in, with the program and, and moving it forward. They started with the two-year Associates of uh, Applied Science and now there's a certificate program. And uh, the students continue to get placed in, in the industry and have good things to say about the program. On an educational standpoint, looking at a residential wind turbine is great. It uh, promotes basically every component on a wind turbine that you would see in a commercial based wind turbine. Now, it is a great thing. It should provide some offset to our electricity usage in the building. And uh, it's a great start to community projects and uh, I believe in it. It's a great process. For the program itself, um, we're going to be able to learn about the cut-in speeds and the wind speed and all the different speeds and variables that um, the, the turbine is going to provide for us. And all that knowledge is based on the same principles in a, in a bigger wind turbine.